Good day, wonderful family. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Thank you for always stopping by. In today's video, I want to share with us a very powerful recipe, okay? You can use to attract good luck to your life, okay? You can equally use this to open ways for yourself, okay? Yes. Many people come to me that things are not working well for them. Everywhere is blocked. Whatever they lay their hands on does not work, okay? That is why I make videos almost every day on prosperity and good luck, okay? Please, whenever you watch the videos, try to carry out the ones you can assess the remedies or the recipes I use on the video, okay? So that you will actually get what you're looking for. You don't just watch a video without practicing it, then you come to me, you know, for me to tell you what to do. All these ones are for free. That is why I'm putting it up on the channel. They're all for free. So look for anyone you can assess the recipes, no matter your location. There are so many videos on the channel. I have over 300 videos on the channel that can help you. There is no how you will do one or two of them that your life will remain the same. Okay? Yeah, I've come again with another simple one that you can assess the materials I'm going to share today. By the grace of God, no matter your location, you can be able to assess the materials. Okay? Yes, this is very simple but very, very powerful. I gave it to a lady that runs a catering business or was it catering, catering business. She came back with her testimony. That was some time ago. So I thought it would be wise for me to share the recipes I gave the lady, okay? Yes, because after some time of using this recipe, she came back with a very big testimony. So I want all of us to partake in this video and please make sure you carry out this assignment, okay? Don't just watch and keep it. Carry it out and see how th those things will start working well for you. It pains me that you come to me for open doors and all that, okay? When there are free videos on the channel that you can do on your own, okay? Yeah, with me here is my cinnamon. This is my pounded cinnamon, okay? I, I bought the stick one and pounded it by myself. So I'll be sure that I'm actually using cinnamon. The next one I have is my good luck incense. This is my good luck incense, okay? Then the last one is sand from the market. I didn't bring it here. Okay, any big market in your area, just get sand from there or a big church or a big school. Anywhere that you know that people gather a lot, church, school, or market. These are the three places you are going to get the sand. Anywhere you can get, you must not get the three sands from these three places. No, you either get from the church, a very big church, okay? Or you get from the school. Or you get from the market. Okay, for those that will ask me, can they get these three sands? The answer is no. I just want a sand from a particular place. Okay. Now, what you are going to do, you are going to get the sand. Put it in something you can, you know, maybe a plate or a cup. Okay. Please, when you're packing the sand, do not use your bare hands. You can use hanky or nylon to wear on your hand. Do not use your hand to pack bare, uh, bare sand. Uh, do not use your bare hand to pack sand. Okay, use your hanky or wear something, or a glove or something on your hand to pack the sand. Then get your good luck incense. Okay, this is my good luck incense. This is how it looks like okay so you are going to be using four of it the four stands for the market days we have in Igbo land i equally stand from the four cardinal points we have which is the south east west and north okay so whichever one you know how to pray you pray with it okay you equally stand from your front your back your right and your left so whichever way you're praying with Okay, me, I prefer to pray with the four market days we have in Igbo land because they are very, very powerful. Okay, so when you get the sand, 
You can get something like this. Get the sand. Add your cinnamon, okay? Then you mix it together. Then get your good looking scent. Four of it like this. Let it stand and burn, okay? So remember I said the four of them stand from east, west, north, and south. Or a K Oreo, which is the four market days we have in Igbo land. Now, what you are going to do, as the incense is burning, know that the ashes will pour in inside this container, depending on the size of the container you are using. If the container you are using is as small as this, you know that it will burn and pour on the ground. So you get something like a tray or a plate and put under this. So that when you finish burning, you pack the ashes and mix it with that sand and cinnamon. Okay? Please get it well. Get your good luck incense. Get your sand. This should be your sand, not your cinnamon. Okay? You put your uh, incense stand, incense stick inside that sand. Add cinnamon to that sand and mix it. Okay? Use your third finger to mix it. Okay? Or you get a spoon. Okay? Then, take your stand and put inside that stand, and that sand, your incense. Point it like this inside the sand. Let it burn. Then, use the ashes and mix it with the cinnamon and sand. Okay? As it's burning, pray that let God open your ways. God should remove every obstacle, every blockages, blocking your ways, blocking your career, blocking your destiny. Okay? That you came to this life to succeed, that you never go home or you never be poor in this life. You never beg for food. You know, things that are bothering you, whatever it is that has to do with prosperity. Please say it as the incense is burning. Okay? Then after that, carry the ashes, mix it with that sand and cinnamon you already have. Then keep it every morning. If you want to bath, take a pinch of it, a little of it, add to your bathing water, and pray that as you go out today, that you only be attracted to good luck, favor, prosperity, open doors, okay? That poverty and stagnation is not for you, okay? That God should elevate you from where you are to the next level of prosperity. Okay, if you're the type looking for promotion, tell God to promote you to make things turn around things for your sake. Okay, when you do this prayer, believe you me, you must see changes in your life. I'm going to do this, but every morning until that sand and ashes and cinnamon mixture finishes. Okay, as you're doing it, please say your intention as you're bathing. Please, you're not going to use soap and sponge for this spiritual bath. Take your normal bath, then take this water and you know, bath again, okay? For those that will ask me how many days are they going to take the bath, remember I said until the sand finishes. So it might take a month or two months, depending on the quantity you brought, okay? So there is no particular day to finish this sand. Please do not carry out this assignment if you're in your menses, okay? Another thing is uh, when you're carrying out this sand, learn to give. Give people the beggars. Okay, give people that you know you're better than not your family members. When you give your family members money, that is not giving. Give to people that you don't know, give to strangers that really need help. Not the one you go and you that do PR, you go and give one commissioner money so that you give you slots. That one is not giving. Give to people that you're better than that is giving. Okay, don't go and give a big man that don't that won't even appreciate the gift. Okay, give it to people that will pray for you. I will say, God bless you. That God bless you is not just an ordinary God bless you. We see God blessing you in real life. Okay? Yes. Thank you for watching the video. And see you in my next video. Have a blessed day ahead. Bye-bye.